Hey, welcome to Flight Test. I'm Josh. Today we are at MTSU, and I'm going to be touring the maintenance program. This group is installing some fuel nozzles, so we were doing a mandatory inspection. One of the requirements was to clean and inspect the fuel nozzles, which are done periodically. So this group has done that. They removed the fuel nozzles, uh, they cleaned them and flow checked them yeah. uh, per the maintenance manual, and now they're reinstalling them with new O-rings and new gaskets and new hardware. Uh, just another example of what they would do routinely in the, in the industry as part of routine maintenance. This is the airframe and power plant uh, maintenance management program. It's a four year, uh, it serves two purposes. We get a bachelor of science degree in aerospace maintenance management. Okay. And we also serve the FAA mechanics <laughs> industry as we provide them with their airframe and power plant certificate. In layman's terms, they not only know their stuff, but they're certified. Yes, okay. and, and, and with the emphasis here is, is towards a management goal. Hopefully they can advance into a management position fairly quickly. It's all about being mentored. It's all about sharing your information. Yeah. You can't be a silo in this industry. A lot of it is not just necessarily technical data, but also safety. Currently, this is my turbine inspection class. So all we did this semester was concentrate on inspecting and troubleshooting turbine engines. This is a mid-level class. They've already had intro to turbine engines. So now we're taking that building on the those initial blocks. Now they're actually out there on an engine. Everything for your program is actually right here in this building too. They can actually learn about it, then they can go over and actually do it. Can't yes, they? exactly. We always start off a little day with at least a lecture or at least a safety briefing. And then you end up here, the Right, here's the plan. Here's what we're going to do today. Kind of run it like a real shop. Here's the deal. Here's what we got to get done today. Yeah. This was donated to us by FedEx, and our maintenance people use this. They run the engines, they run the auxiliary power plant that's in it. They're able to still do a lot of stuff with this aircraft. You're welcome to go on up and yeah, check it out. Is. Something like this isn't airworthy, but everything has to be operational. And it has to start operational, and then you get to fix it, and then bring it back to operational, huh? That's how it works. Where are we now? This is the overhaul shop. The maintenance students come in here at the start of the semester. You guys, you guys, you each have one. Take it apart, overhaul it rebuild it guess what they got to do at the end of the semester start the engine they got to start the engine up special props that are on there the size and scope of those props give it the true feel of what a prop on that engine would be it loads the engine well but it's, it's still a safety feature real hands-on program that we have here you can even see in the classrooms a lot of these parts are in the classrooms it's very very hands-on for our maintenance students in our program so you know typically when you work on a car in your garage you're like oh where'd this extra bolt go oh, i'm sure it's fine and you throw it to the side that is not an option when it comes to aviation. No. You do not leave a bolt. You put every tool that you took out, you put every tool away. There is no compromise on it. It has to be done perfectly. And the training is much more intense because you, do, you don't get to pull over when you're flying through the air. Mm -hmm. you, uh, you're flying, you, you gotta land. You know, sometimes you can't land where you want to. So the urgency of proper training is super important. Yeah, yeah. these guys get good training, so. Friends, this whole journey going through MTSU Aerospace Program has been a real pleasure, but this one right here is really one that touches my heart. Uh, an AMP mechanic is the one that found problems with my personal airplane that quite possibly saved my life. So this is a, a field that not only keeps people flying, but also keeps life safe. We'll see you next time.